Before we step through an active measurement with GeoSeeker, let's have a quick look at the package contents. Apart from the power cable drums, everything fits into a robust Paley case. Right after opening the case, you see four electrodes attached to the upper shell, two power electrodes and two voltage electrodes. Even if you watch this video, please read the user's manual. There are much more important information concerning the usage of GeoSeeker. By default, the GeoSeeker comes with a pre-configured Android tablet PC, if not otherwise ordered. You will get the tablet PC along with a proper charger and USB cable. There are two short extension cables that are used to connect the power electrodes with the power cable drums. One centerpiece of GeoSeeker is the controller, which is used, as the name already implies, to control all data transfer as well as the measurement process. There are two small voltage cable drums attached to it. The controller is powered by eight AA batteries. If you are using rechargeable batteries, you may use this charger to recharge the batteries within the controller. By using the tablet PC holder, you are able to mount your tablet PC directly on top of the controller. The USB power pack comes with a charger and is used to supply your tablet PC with additional power, especially during long-lasting measurements. This charger is used to recharge the built-in battery of the Peli case, or, as we call it, the power box. More information about charging your equipment we will explain in the next chapter of this video. The travel adapter can be used as an interface for international power sockets, so you can charge your equipment worldwide, no matter where you are. 